Uh, of course, the name of this spot was called the Treehouse. So Kendall and um, Larry came up with the idea, man, we need a paint up in here, man, but it need to represent, uh, 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 you know, a great figure, something that somebody that was influenced, we was influenced by. Um, then we came up with the idea. Once they sat down, they came to me with the idea as far as, man, we're going to do Jay-Z. And then we want that, we want a little twist with it, man, with the trees. And when they came up with that idea, Kendall was like, man, you know what? There's only one person I feel like I can really execute that high of a go, man. It's, 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 it's my partner, Jaron. So they reached out to me. We sat down. I sketched it up. Um, and they were like, cool, there's a go. And then once we sketched it up, delivered the painting, um, Larry posted it. I posted it. And it just went crazy from there, man. And, I mean, we had people reaching out, man, uh, just connecting the dots, man. And just, it just went crazy. Leonard Fournette reached out. Leonard Fournette was a, played a big part in that as well, man, to get that connection with Jay-Z. Of course, you know he's with uh, Rock Nation Sports. So, man, that was, it just went crazy, man. And, of course, from that point, Jay-Z reached out, purchased it. Uh, nice still right now as we speak, sitting in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in Cleveland, man. So if you haven't had a chance to check it out at the Treehouse, you still have a chance to check it out at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, man. So that was, that was a huge deal, man. You know, not too many people, um, not too many people buying paintings of themselves of that magnitude. Jay Z owned three hundred, well, I would say about over two two hundred million. I want to say two hundred million dollars worth of art, and he had one of mine, you know. So. That's a big deal, deal, man. That's a big deal, man. I think that's, that was something huge for the city of New Orleans. I want to give you, you know, up with your flowers right now appreciate while you smell them. Yeah, appreciate but it. I want to know this question. How long did it actually take to actually paint? Um, well, how I paint, man, um, it depends on... See, and that when I was doing that painting, man, I felt something different about that painting. I paint, that's all I do, man. Uh, but that painting probably took maybe four weeks off and on. I would say I probably put... Eight hours, skip a day, cause I I have multiple things I do, um, so I was multitasking be, between the paintings. I said it took maybe four weeks off and on because we was uh, actually the, the timeline for the treehouse to open was pushed back, so it saved me another week. So thank God for that. I had a chance to really go in fully, and it, I didn't, it didn't feel rushed at that point. So at that point, I started detailing. I do my base layers. I started detailing it, but I would say a good a good hundred hours, man. A hundred hours off and on within four weeks. 